we now discuss the solution of a problem that was given in joint entrance examination main and the problem is based on the principle of inclusion and exclusion and the question was given in jee main held on 22nd july 2021 in the afternoon shift the problem is the sum of all the elements in the set the set consisting of n belongs to the set consisting of the numbers 1 2 3 up to 100 such that hcf the highest common factor of n and 2040 is 1 is equal to solution let x be the set that denotes the set of all natural numbers 1 to up to 100 1 2 3 up to 100 let y be a subset of x s of y denotes the sum of the elements of y then s of x is the sum of the elements of the set x that is 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 100 and that is equal to n into n plus 1 by 2 where n is 100 100 into 101 by 2 that is when simplified it will get 5000 5050 the prime factorization of 2040 is 2 cube into 3 into 5 into 17 note that if n belongs to the set x and n is not a multiple of 2 3 5 and 17 then the hcf of n and 2040 is 1 let s be the set of all the elements of x which are relatively prime to 2040 let a b c and d be the sets of all elements of x which are multiples of 2 3 5 and 17 respectively then a union b union c union d is the set of all elements of x which are multiples of either 2 or 3 or 5 or 17 then s is the sum of all the elements of x which are relatively prime to 2040 is given by sx that is the sum of all the elements of x minus s of a union b union c union d so s is equal to s of x minus s of a union b union c union d s of x is 5050 minus s of a union b union c union d we will now compute what is s of a union b union c union d first we take s of a that is the sum of all the elements of x which are multiples of 2 that is 2 plus 4 plus 6 plus up to 100 and that is sa is equal to 2 into 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus etc up to 50 that is 2 into 50 into 51 by 2 that is 2550 yes of b s of b is the sum of all the elements of x which are multiples of 3 that is 3 plus 6 plus 9 plus up to 99 that is 3 into 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus plus up to 33 that is equal to that is equal to 3 times the sum of the first 33 natural numbers that is 33 into 34 by 2 when simplified we will get 1683 yes of c that is equal to the sum of the elements of x which are multiples of 5 that is 5 plus 10 plus 15 plus 100 that is 5 into 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus etc up to 20 and that is equal to 5 into the sum of the first 20 natural numbers that is 20 into 21 by 2 when simplified we'll get 1050 
s of d is the sum of all the elements of x which are multiples of 17 that is 17 plus 34 plus 51 plus up to 85 that is 17 multiplied by 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 and that is equal to 255. Now, S of A plus S of B plus S of C plus S of D, when you added all these things, is 5538. Now, A intersection B denotes the set of all elements of X which are multiples of 2 and 3. That is, S of A intersection B will be the sum of all the elements of X which are multiples of 2 into 3 because the GCD of 2 and 3 is 1. So that will be multiples of 6. 6 plus 12 plus 18 plus up to 96 and that is 6 taken common. That is 2 into 3 taken common will be 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus up to 16. That will be 6 into 16 multiplied by 17 by 2 that is 816. S of A intersection C sum of all the elements of x which are multiples of 2 and 15, 2 and 5, that is 2 into 5 into 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus up to 10 and that is 550. S yes, of A intersection D, that is all mult sum of the all the elements of x which are multiples of 2 and 17, that is 2 into 17 into 1 plus 2 only those, those, those two elements only, that is 1 or 2. S of B intersection C, that is uh, all those elements of X which are multiples of uh, 3 and 5, that is 3 into 5 into 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus up to 6, and that is 315. And S of B intersection D is 3 into 17, there is only one element, that is 51. And S of C intersection D, that is 5 into 17, there is only one element, that is 85. Now, S of A intersection B plus S of A intersection C plus S of A intersection D, and sum of all these things will be 1919. Now, A intersection B intersection C, the set of all elements of X which are multiples of 2, 3, and 5 that is equal to the S of A intersection B intersection C is the sum of all the elements of X which are multiples of 2 into 3 into 5 that is 30 plus 60 plus 90 and 2 into 3 into 5 into 1 plus 2 plus 3 that is 30 into 6 is 180. S of A intersection B intersection D the sum of all the elements of X which are multiples of 2 into 3 into 17 there are, there are no there are no elements in X which are multiples of 2 into 3 into 17. That is, uh, 3 into 17 is 51 into 2, 102. It exceeds 100. Therefore, there are, there are no elements. Therefore, there is no sum. S of A intersection B intersection D is also the sum of all the elements of X which are multiples of 2 into 15 into 17 which exceeds 100. Therefore, the sum is 0. And so also, S of B intersection C intersection D is 0. And the sum of... Uh, sum of all the elements of x which are multiples of 3 into 5 into 17 is also 0. So, S of A intersection B intersection C plus S of A intersection B intersection D, S of A intersection C intersection D plus S of B intersection C intersection D is 180. And now, the sum of all the elements, uh, all those elements of x which are multiples of 2, 3, 5 and 17 is given by S of A intersection B intersection C intersection D and 2 into 3 into 5 into 17 exceeds 100. Therefore, the sum is 0. So, now we use the principle of uh, inclusion and exclusion. S of A union B union C union D is equal to S is equal to S of A plus S of B plus S of C plus S of D minus in brackets S of A intersection B plus S of A intersection C plus S of A intersection D plus S of B intersection C plus S of B intersection D plus S of C intersection D taken two at a time plus S of taken three at a time A intersection B intersection C plus S of A intersection B intersection D plus S of A intersection C intersection D plus S of B intersection C intersection D minus 
S of A intersection, B intersection, C intersection, D. All these things we have already computed, we will put down now. So, the sum is 3,799. Thus, the required sum is given by S is equal to 5,050 5, minus S of A union, B union, C union, D. And that is uh, 1,251. That is the answer for the given question. And uh, I know that this question can be solved by a simpler method. But the method what I have explained is a, is a systematic enumeration of the sum of the elements. Therefore, this method is applicable in all situations. Suppose, instead of 2040, given a bigger number, and instead of 1 to 100, suppose they are given 1 to 10,000, then it becomes very, very difficult, and that the method what people are following will not work and will be very, very tedious. Whereas, this method will work and easy to compute. I hope that you have understood the solution of this problem and appreciate the method that I have given. And I wish you all the best. Thank you.